target audience of, uh, of people needing family legal work who spends a lot of time in Avo. I'm going to answer your questions, but I'm constantly going to be pushing you back to my website and my blog where you can read more about me and you can interact <coughs> more with me. That's somebody who's really partying in the community, being a good participant by actually giving value, but pulling them into that core, pushing them into that core web presence. Okay, social media opportunity, the video opportunity. Video is changing everything, okay? So, um, first of all, video is great because it, it lets you distinguish yourself. I mean, it allows you to show who you are. And what's really interesting is a lot of lawyers hate to be on camera, but you're excellent speakers. And so you need to learn just how to appear well on a camera. And the first time, that you shoot video of yourself, it's going to stink. You're going to hate it, right? I'm just telling you. You'll feel slouch. And you'll be like, but over time, you'll understand how to project to a camera. And to the extent that you can get that in front of a potential client, or even an existing client, or a referring attorney, really valuable stuff. For websites, uh, that have video as part of them, they are visited 20% more often on average per month. And we even see this within the Avo system. In the Avo ecosystem, to the extent that people are posting videos, we watch those videos being viewed over and over and over. I actually chatted with a, with a lawyer last night who is one of the better legal marketers that I know, uh, David. Yeah. And uh, he was talking about how he includes video in it because it brings himself to life when he's interacting with clients. And really, really valuable stuff. One of the biggest reasons that it's valuable, we're back to Google, but Google loves video content. Okay, so here's Chris Davis. He's a very, very media savvy. Uh, personal injury lawyer in town. You'll actually see Mr. Davis. You'll see his wife here, uh, who does all this marketing. But uh, his very first Google search result is his site. But the next two search results are videos about him. Now, can anyone guess why Google likes YouTube videos so much? <laughs> anyone? Google owns YouTube. Okay, so YouTube's also pretty big in its own right, but you put YouTube together and Google search together, 